It's time to gear up and dive into the world of Counter-Strike 2. With its exciting new features and months of anticipation, this game has definitely lived up to the hype. However, amidst all the new elements, some familiar aspects of CSGO might be a bit tricky to find. Don't worry, though I've got your back. Today, I am going to show you exactly how to track your damage dealt in Cease 2. When it comes to seeing your damage output in Counter-Strike 2, there are a couple of places you need to look. The first spot is the end of the round screen or the scoreboard. Once the round ends, you'll find the stats displayed right underneath the avatar of each player at the top of your screen. Now, pay close attention here because there are two numbers you need to focus on. The first number, highlighted in green, tells you how much damage you've inflicted on that specific player. The second, smaller number indicates the number of shots it took to deal that amount of damage. So, if you dealt 25 damage in two hits, it will show up as 25 and two under the player's avatar. Now, I know what you're thinking sometimes. Things can get a little wonky during the match, especially when you die and respawn. But fear not, because this damage indicator has been proven to be reliable at the very end of the match when the winning team is declared. So, keep an eye out for those stats when the round concludes. The CS2 scoreboard is a treasure trove of information that can help you assess your performance and the skills of other players in the server. While statistics alone may not give you the complete picture of a player's abilities, after all, they don't reveal the strategic smoke plays or clutch moments. Understanding all the stats on the scoreboard can be highly beneficial. Take note of the damage dealt indicator as well as other interesting data like the number of enemies flashed with your well-placed flashes.